Welcome to this episode of Cooking with Kirby. Today we're going to be doing some crispy shrimp in the air fryer. This is a very simple recipe and you know what? It is delicious. So, no further ado, let's get into the recipe so I can show you how to make it. We're going to start off by using some peeled, deveined large shrimp. You want the tail on there so that way you can pick it up. Now you want to just go ahead and give it a coating of some cornstarch. I'm doing a small batch so I'm only using about one tablespoon. It doesn't even actually take all of that. You know, I just gave it a swirl and, and covered everything, make sure everything was nice and covered with the cornstarch. Now you're gonna need some egg for egg wash and some panko breadcrumbs. Uh, depending on how much shrimp you're gonna be doing, you'll probably need two. And for the seasoning, we went with Sweet Smoky Joe's Creole Cake. I love this stuff. This, this is growing on me. It's a good Cajun seasoning. That's, I've been getting into the Cajun seasoning, so we're gonna go ahead and add one tablespoon into that egg wash. And just make sure that you give it a good mix because uh, it's gonna get muddy on you, but it's gonna add some good flavor to our shrimp. Now for the easy part, all we're gonna do is just dip that battered shrimp into the egg wash and we're gonna just dump it into the panko. That Sweet Smoky Joe Creole Kick is really, really good on seafood, fish. Uh, I even put it on chicken and it comes out really, really good. And make sure you give a good coating on that shrimp. Uh, you want to kind of like crunch it down a little bit and just make sure it's coated well. Once it's done, now we want to go ahead and preheat our air fryer. So we're going to go ahead and preheat our air fryer to 400 degrees and we're going to set the cook time for 12 minutes. Once it's preheated, go ahead and put all your shrimp in there. This was a small batch. I know I could have fit a lot more. I could. I could have probably tripled that size of shrimp that I, I did, but uh, yeah, it, the air fryer definitely does hold a lot more. And then you want to just go ahead and spray just a tad bit of oil right there on top. I'm using a little bit of olive oil. Now just close it up and let it do its thing. At the six minute mark, you want to go ahead and flip your shrimp so that way you can get that other side nice and crispy. Now you just want to spray just a tad little bit of oil right there on that other side of the shrimp and just go ahead and let it cook and once it's done you got a beautiful crispy shrimp let me know what you think about that recipe in the comment section this was very very easy and you know what? it's very delicious you should try it out as always i'll leave the link down in the video description that way you can get the full printable recipe at cookingwithkirby.com oh yeah I have these recipes. They're very good. You should try them out. Now y'all be beautiful and take care.